And finally, let's see the reporting abilities of Nessus. Open a browser and go to Nessus Service. HTTPS, localhost, and port 8834. Log in with your credential. And here are the scans we performed before. I've only one for now, uh, but click on it and see the details. In the upper right-hand corner, there's an export combo box. When you click on it, you see the report types of Nessus Home. So let's generate a PDF report first. We have two options in the Home Edition, and you'll have other options if you buy the Professional Edition. So I choose Custom here, and as you see, we have only two options in Home Edition. You can group the vulnerabilities by host or plugin. I choose the host. And click Export to generate the report in PDF format. Save it or open it now. I'll choose Open, and that way you can see it. So the file is downloaded into the temp folder. And here's a scan report in PDF format. Vulnerabilities are grouped by hosts. I'll click the Metasploitable header. Now there's a few lines of brief summary, then the explanation of the vulnerabilities start. As you see, the vulnerabilities are not sorted by the severity level, which is not good. Of course, you can sort them in the Professional Edition. That's where they get you. So now, let's see the Vulnerability Assessment Report in HTML format. Same home page with a PDF option. This time, I'll choose the Executive Summary option and click Export. Open it with Firefox. And here is a report in HTML format. A single frame for each host. Click the Show Details button to see the vulnerabilities list of the host. If you want to have detailed information about a vulnerability, click on it. The HTML file redirects you to the online web pages of Tenable Security.